A man, a very warm welcome to Field Mill. You must be relieved somewhat to have signed for us after the troubles at your previous club Kettering. Yeah, well, mainly it's relief just because now I can concentrate on my football and um, hopefully enjoy myself um, without thinking about any of the politics behind behind the scenes and stuff. So yeah, definitely relieved. Has it been difficult these past few weeks for you? Um, I wouldn't say difficult, I've just been trying to concentrate on the football but it's hard when other things are going on and people are trying to get you involved in stuff. You just want to concentrate on playing. So how long has this move been in the offing? Um, the first I heard of it was Tuesday, I think, so only a couple of days ago. Um, and tried to get it done so it, as soon as possible, basically. Any other clubs after you? Um, I'm, I'm not sure, I don't know about that. You're a central midfielder, what type of midfielder are you? Um, I don't really know. I, I like to get up and down box to box. I like to get on the ball a lot um, and create. And I, I want to score as many as I can. But I just want to help the team win. And hopefully I can do that while I'm, while I'm here. Let's talk about Luke O'Neill. You know him very well from your days at Leicester City. Have you spoken to him about this transfer? Yeah, I've spoke to him earlier today. It's good to be playing with him again because we always did say when we was um, training together previously that we want to be in the same team hopefully soon in the future. So it's come round now, so hopefully we'll enjoy ourselves. He's had good things to say about the club and this season, has he? Yeah, I've only had positive things about the future of this club and um, he's enjoyed himself this season so far. You've had quite a few uh, low moves in recent years, a man. Is it now a time in your career in which you're looking to settle down at one particular club? Yeah, definitely. I think settling down is one of the main things um, for any footballer to do. Just want to concentrate, play good football and be the best you can for this team. What will you be hoping to achieve in the short term and the long term here? You've got 18 months on your contract now. What are those aims? Um... Well, for the short term, um, I'd like to be able to get into the playoffs with this club and um, obviously hopefully get some promotion. Um, long term, if, if, if all is going well, I'd like to stay here and keep, keep playing well and hopefully get a club as high as possible. So if we did get promoted, then go further the next season and the season after that. So how's the manager Paul Cox sold Mansfield Town to you or did it need any selling? Um, I don't think it did regarding my situation that I've been in previously, but um, I know that this club's a good club and it's run properly and um, the manager's been doing well, obviously, with the current situation of the club. Um, the players that are here as well, I've, I've heard of quite a few of them um, and I know a few of them as well, so I'm, I'm happy to sign it, basically. You've played enough games in this league to know what it's all about. What does it take, in your opinion, for a club like Mansfield Town to get into the top five? Well, just got to have that consistency, I think. That's the, that's the main thing in this league, because anyone can beat anyone at this level. Um, it's just as long as you're consistent, you're performing well personally and as a team, um, individuals... It's, it's not really just about individuals, it's about playing together well consistently and hopefully getting uh, results even if you're not playing the best personally. Aman Verma, congratulations on your signing and uh, I wish you the best of luck. Thank you very much. Marcus Kelly, a very warm welcome to Field Mill. How delighted are you to have finally signed? No, I'm, I'm, I'm ecstatic to be fair. Um, it's a great club. I'm looking forward to getting his training tomorrow, seeing the lads. Um, I know a few already, so um, so I'll surely fit in quite quickly. I'm just looking forward to it now, yep. Was it hard for you to leave, Kettering? Because last season you were successful personally. You had a clean sweep at the end of season awards, I believe. Yeah, I enjoyed my time at Kettering. Last, yeah, as you say, last season I, I got player of the season, so that was nice personally for me, but um, I'm moving on now. And uh, yeah, I'm just looking forward to my time at Mansfield. Would you say this was the right time for you to move? Definitely, yeah. I'm, I'm at a stage in my career, 25 now. I'm in my peak. Um, so hopefully I can perform well on the pitch and, um, and we'll get the benefits and we'll look for that promotion that I, I think that the squad we've got here that are capable of. How does it compare to Kettering? 
actually perhaps an unfair question because uh, it, it's falling to pieces a bit there, isn't it? Yeah, it's to be honest, it, it is. So it's a good time for me to get out. Um, all the best to the people back there. I hope it. I hope it's uh, not as bad as it seems at the minute in the future. But as I say, I'm a, I'm a stag now, and I'm just looking forward to getting out on the pitch and performing well for for Mansfield. You've signed in the same hour as Aman Verma. Of course, he's come from Kettering as well. Does that help? Um, yeah, I suppose it helps. Some familiar faces around the club that I already know. I, f I was at Oxford with three of them. Um, a couple of came on loan. Well, Luke came on loan last season from from Leicester at the time. Um, so yeah, it's it's nice to know some people, so you fit in quite quick. What can we expect of a man, and what can we expect of you? Uh, well. He's sitting next to me, so I'm a little bit under pressure. But no, nah, nah. be honest. A man's a good, a man's a fantastic player. I enjoy playing with him at the start of this season, so I'm looking forward to it. And yourself? Well, just total class, really. <laughs> nah, nah, um Yeah, I'll just be a, a nippy little winger. I think I think I've been um, signed here to play on the on the left wing, so hopefully I can deliver some some good crosses for the strikers to put in. Will you look to head straight into the lineup on Saturday at Bath? Um, no, that's, that's not up to me. That's up to the manager. I've, I've, obviously, I've signed here hoping that that I'll be playing every week. I like to think that um, I'll give the team a little something different. Um, so it's up to the manager. If I start, I'm going to give 100%. If I don't, I'm going to wait for my chance and hopefully take it when I do. Tell me about your personal goals then. My personal goals? Um, hopefully one day... I'll play back in the league. I started my, I made my debut in the league, and hopefully I can get back there. Um, hopefully higher than I've already played. I'd, I'd love to, I'd love to play in the championship. I know it's a big stretch, but I don't think it's uh, impossible. But in the short term, I'd love promotion with the Stags, um, and then, and then kick on for another promotion. I, I want to win championships. I want to be successful. So hopefully I can do that here. Marcus Kelly, thanks for your time. Thank you.